Hey everybody, how's it going? Today, I'm happy to bring you the 2012 Mercedes-Benz S65 AMG V12 by Turbo. And this is going to be a full, in-depth tour of the S65. We'll start it up, show the engine, get an exhaust clip and go over the performance data, and show you a bunch of the features on the interior as well as exterior. And today, I'm at Hendrick Motors of Charlotte, North Carolina. And so, without further ado, let's go ahead and start it up, let it run. This vehicle also comes with Mercedes Smart Key Access System. All you have to do is keep the key fob in your pocket. And by locating the little touch sensitive buttons on each of the door handles, you're able to lock and unlock the vehicle. Just tap it. Locks it, folds the mirrors in, and after waiting a second, just grab the handle, and it automatically unlocks it. Auto self-closing doors. It's a black exterior with the signature S65 diamond quilted premium AMG leather interior. Like I said, this pattern is only seen on the V12 models. Black piano veneer trim. Does have push button ignition. Put your foot on the brake. Hit the button to start. Very elegant. Gotta love the melodic note of a V12. The steering wheel is trimmed in stitched leather, as well as black piano veneer. And you also have a stitched leather airbag cover. AMG specific rack and pinion power steering. Nice and smooth, good feedback. The five speed automatic transmission in the S65 is the standard and only transmission option. It's able to handle large amounts of torque put out by the V12 as well as impressive durability, as favored over the seven speed that's in the S63 and S550. In order to engage, just pull straight down for drive. Push straight up for reverse. Also has a backup camera with integrated guidance lines. And park. And so, let's go ahead and cut on the headlights. It does have automatic lights, fog lights, as well as the hazards. All the windows are fully automatic. And let's go ahead and check out the exterior, shall we? Bi Xenon projector headlamps with adaptive high beam assist as well as cornering lights, LED turn signals, as well as LED daytime running lights. Signature vents, unique body styling to the S65, front parking assist, as well as a myriad of other safety innovations such as lane departure warning assist, pre collision detection system, as well as laser guided cruise control. Also retractable headlight washers, integrated hood vents, on the S65 you also have 20 inch AMG twin 5 spoke forged light alloy wheels on high performance tires, 255-35 in the front and 275-35 in the rear. Also, as for the brakes, you have internally ventilated and cross-drilled discs with dual sliding calipers, 
both logo with the AMG insignia, with the same setup in the back, only with a single sliding caliper instead of a dual setup. Panoramic glass roof. Automatic rain sensing wipers. As well as LED turn signal mirrors with lane departure warning assist as well as blind spot detection. And they're also heated. LED tail lamps. Quad chrome exhaust tips with rear parking assist. LED license plate lights in your rear backup camera. And let's go ahead and pop the hood. The S65 comes with a completely hand-built 6-liter twin-turbocharged 32-valve V12. Produces a whopping 621 horsepower at 4,800 RPM and around 738 foot-pounds of torque at around 2,000 to 4,000 RPM. The 0 to 60 acceleration in about 4.2 seconds with an electronically limited top speed of around 186 miles an hour. It's assigned one technician from beginning to end with final production having their name signed on the top of the engine block. It also has a carbon fiber engine cover. EPA estimated miles per gallon rating for the S65 on premium unleaded gas is around 12 city, 19 highway. And also to increase structural rigidity in the front end, you get three sets of hood anchors, which help improve front end stability and reduce any swaying caused by the front end um, by keeping more contact with the hood to the frame. The interior of the S65 is second to none, combining some of the finest quality materials as well as unique styling cues. Like I said, the V12 specific diamond stitch leather interior. The entire door panels are in fact covered in leather. Padded storage, the color contrast stitching, storage pockets, power windows, power mirrors, like I showed you at the beginning, power folding for both sides. You also have your power trunk release here, lock and unlock. Also, increased sound dampening with your dual pane glass. 14-way power adjustable perforated seating with heavy side bolstering, brown color contrast stitching running across the sides with the AMG logo stamped in the back of the seat. All of your power seat controls are located on your door, which include your standard adjustments here, power sliding lower cushion, power tilt and adjust for the headrest, three-stage heated as well as ventilated seats for the driver and passenger, as well as your three-person memory. And you also have four-way lumbar adjustment as well as individual adjustment for your side bolstering and your active massage system. I'll show all of that in just a little bit. Aluminum AMG door sills, logo floor mats and aluminum sport pedals, as well as a full power tilting telescope and steering wheel. And just as the doors, the dash is also wrapped in a sumptuous amount of stitched leather amongst your black piano veneer trim. Runs the length of the entire vehicle. You also have a full Alcantara headliner. You see your panoramic roof. So let's go ahead and see if she sounds. You have a rev limiter around 3,000 RPM.
Kayla's gonna shut it up. This vehicle also comes with the premium Bang & Olufsen surround sound system. You see the tweeters integrated into the door here, also lit. And it's all controlled down here on the center console. See your Alcantara going down your A-pillar, side curtain airbags. Card holder. You also have an auto dimming rear view mirror with integrated compass as well as garage home link. One touch automatic open and close sunroof. Just slides up and out over the rear glass. And your sunshade, also automatic. Padded sunglass container interior illumination, as well as SOS emergency roadside assistance through Mercedes. Also, everything has a nice metallic touch to it, polished aluminum, analog clock. The vehicle also comes with a quad zone automatic climate control, so you can individually adjust the temperature from the driver, passenger seat, as well as both of the rear passengers. It all shows up on your navigation screen here. And if you use the wheel to tilt down all the way, bring up the climate control data. You can also use the wheel twisting left and right, hitting enter, as well as back, and going through your different options. Your different zones. Fan speed, AC, so on and so forth. It's also controlled here. One touch automatic, recycling, front defrost, rear defrost. All pretty self explanatory. Also, up here, if you click this button right here, it brings up all of the different positions and settings for your seating, for driver and passenger seats. Adjusting the pitch, as well as lumbar adjustment, active massage. Lumbar support, side bolstering adjustment to hug you in tighter, and also automatically performs the action as you adjust it. Quite a responsive system. And then just click it over for the passenger side. Your ride height adjustment, sport mode, as well as parking sensor control. As for a little bit more in-depth information on this interface, it's a wheel, kind of similar to BMW's iDrive system in where you can twist left and right, click it up and down, left and right, or hitting enter. All of your basic functions are also controlled here, hands-free telephone navigation, disc, radio, as well as audio options, and you can also control it from the top part of the screen here. If we click the wheel all the way up, we can go over to nav, click it, and it brings up the navigation with real-time traffic updates. Route, position, destination input. And if we click it up again, go back to audio, we can go through the different options. CD player, memory card, SD card input. It's a hard drive based navigation system so you can load up MP3 files. iPod, auxiliary, USB, rear input. It's also DVD compatible. Hands free telephone. ability for video, as well as vehicle settings. Click left and right. Multi-contour seat settings is what I just showed you earlier. Entry exit position. Interior ambient lighting. Basically your customizable settings. Also system options. You have an integrated voice command system as well. Next category.
previous category. And all of the commands are listed within the system and depending on the certain menu you're in, it'll display different commands. So if we go back up to navigation, enter destination. Pre-selected state is North Carolina. Do you want to enter town first or street first? Enter town first. Please say the name of the town. Charlotte. Charlotte, accepted. Please say the name of the street. Cancel. Cancel. And that's pretty much all of the basic functions of the SetNav system. Carbon fiber woven center console, lighter and ashtray, adjustable and removable cup holders, comfort sport manual mode for your transmission, six disc CD changer and your SD card input, also, in traditional Mercedes fashion, you have a power-assisted feature back here that folds down the rear headrest for increased visibility. And then you can raise them back up. Also, your power sunshade control for the rear. Integrated number pad for your telephone. It's also padded in velour. Stitch center console. It's also padded. You also have your hands-free phone controls, radio controls on the steering wheel, as well as an integrated driver information system located within the speedometer. Now the center speedometer is a whole digital setup. Click left and right. Settings for all of your safety systems, pre-collision detection systems, lane departure warning assist, so on and so forth. You also have a nighttime infrared camera that you can use that shows up in the middle of the screen that you can activate when nightfall occurs. Alrighty. And let's go and shut her down. So let's go ahead and check out the back seat. Large rear doors. Also stitched in the same diamond pattern. Went ahead and left the vehicle's power on so I could show you some of the various power features in the back. You can control both of the vehicle's windows in the rear from either side of the seat that you're sitting on, including the sunshades. They all work through the same window switch. And they're also fully automatic. Control your rear sunshade. As well as the top sunroof. Here. All of your color contrast stitching, padded storage, and black piano veneer. Also fully adjustable rear seating in the same fashion as the front seats with three person memory for both sides. They're also three stage heated and ventilated. And just to show you a little bit of the general seat movement. It slides out a good bit for a nice amount of reclining. As well as power headrest adjustment. Whether you want to lay it down, pull it up, providing maximal comfort for long journeys. Your aluminum door sills, logoed floor mats, Alcantara trim, extends all the way down from the C-pillar into the door frame, dual rear monitors for the entertainment system, some more illuminated tweeters for the Bang & Olufsen stereo, carbon fiber around the rear air controls, AC power outlet, and in the center console in the back you also have a similar comfort adjustment as you do in the front seats to adjust side bolstering, lumbar, four-way lumbar adjustment as a matter of fact, as well as active massage.
spot for a remote for the rear entertainment system. LED indicators for the rear parking assist. You also have illuminated vanity mirrors. Code hooks. And side airbags. Now we'll go ahead and check out the rest of the vehicle, shall we? It does have a full power trunk as well. Quick opening, immense amount of cargo space, chrome entry plate. It's also illuminated with side storage pockets and your spare tire. Place to put your cap. immensely comfortable. All of the same power adjustments. Large glove box, your integrated remote for the sat nav and entertainment system, iPod integration as well as auxiliary, 12 volt power outlet, USB, as well as an integrated cool box function that filters into air conditioning to keep items chilled. It's an impeccably designed German luxury sedan. Prestigious power, plenty of luxury features, and gorgeous styling. Definitely a timeless vehicle. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this in-depth tour on the 2012 Mercedes-Benz S65 AMG. Be sure to stay tuned next time. There's a lot more where that came from. Take care, everybody.